The Real Housewives of New Jersey castmate Joe Gorga is facing backlash after making a disgusting joke about Dolores Catania at a recent comedy gig. One fan expressed shock at his remarks, writing Kalth, Imagine what he's saying in private. Joseph and his spouse Melissa are presumed to be friends with Dolores. Nonetheless, Joe recently referred to Paul, her lover, as a scumbag. The spouse's stories are a major focus of only one Real Housewives series, Real Housewives of New Jersey. Previous remarks Joe made about women on the program, particularly Teresa Giudice, his sister, with whom he is currently at odds, have outraged a lot of people. Joe was at Atlantic City at the Harrah's Resort for a comedy gig on August 17. He joked about the show's drama's authenticity in one scene. Sure, he said, regretfully, it's all true on what was formerly known as Twitter. I will reveal to you something that isn't true, he continued. They have their lips, teeth, hair extensions, and even the cookie all because of Dolores. In the video's comments, viewers attacked Joe harshly. One individual expressed how completely repulsive this was. It is not humorous, not even somewhat. Imagine his private remarks if he is making them in public. A second person added, How dare you use women who have given you and your family a career? Initially, attempt to laugh at both yourself and your other housemates. Is Dolores your friend? A third remarked, I'd be off if my friend's husband said this about me. He authored a fourth because he is fascinated with talking about ladies other than his wife. Revolting. No class. Is there anything more to his existence than housewives? Echoed a fifth fan. He makes jokes about them all the time, I promise. Anything to maintain currentness. A sixth exclaimed, What a tool. Observe the mirror on the wall. Who of them is the most douchey? Hash Joe Agorga, I won't even begin to discuss Melissa and Marge. Not a fan of Tree, although I did rewatch most of the seasons. Quite clear now. My spouse enjoys watching the majority of the Housewives series, and we both think that themen from New Jersey are far more sensitive than the women have ever imagined, stated another. The worst of the lot is this specific individual. Danielle Cabral talked about her bad connection with her brother Tommy during season 13 of Real Housewives of New Jersey. A wall had also been reached. She later said in season 14 regarding her relationship with her father, Philip DiPietro. Following Danielle's brother's rejection of a present that she had delivered, a fresh divide developed. Danielle retreated from her parents after learning about their father's lackluster backing. I am now reporting to you live from New Jersey, where Danielle just wrote about her most recent charity event. To her surprise, her father is there, supporting her wholeheartedly. Danielle recently threw a benefit party to collect money for the Sunrise Day Camp on Staten Island. Every summer, this day camp opens to provide a safe haven for kids with cancer to just play and have fun. Because to kind donations and events such as Danielle's, they and their siblings may attend this camp for free.